look like glue inside your mind Just watch me break in your sleep Never thought it would be so hard I grew up without a scar Just living my life with no big worries And I've always known what I want Just didn't know what came along Finding myself a much less happy Back in Uh uh, this oatmeal is not sitting right with me I can't keep anything down Sing. Everyone judging me Don't wanna care about them Though it hurts so bad I think it's about time I take this test Because what is going on? Open. Okay, so how do I do this again? How to use a clear blue pregnancy test Remove the test stick from the wrapper and take off the cap, okay? Place the absorbent tip in your urine stream for five seconds. This part is so gross. Keep the absorbent tip pointing downwards throughout the testing process, okay? And replace the cap and lay stick flat. Okay, now I just have to wait three minutes. Layla, are you in there? Uh, why do you look so worried? What's wrong? Oh, hey, babe. Look, I'm gonna cut straight to the point. I have this tracking app for my cycle, and it's always accurate. Okay, I was supposed to start two whole weeks ago, but I haven't gotten it yet. Are you being serious? And I've been feeling nauseous on top of that. So, I went and took a pregnancy test. So, did you get the results yet? No, I was waiting for you to get back because I want both our initial reactions to it. Okay, well, I'm ready when you are. No way. Oh my god it's positive what are we gonna do well are you at least happy because you don't seem like it honestly i don't know leela the first time we got a pregnancy scare you were all for it what happened i mean yeah but it was just a scare now it's real and that was a long time ago i'm trying to focus on my classes all of a sudden you don't know are you kidding me you don't even go to your classes anymore so of course you're happy what is that supposed to mean we've been talking about starting a family for a really long time and all of a sudden it becomes a reality and you switch up i mean yeah but not this early in our lives we're still in college and my job doesn't pay well enough to raise a child and you're not even employed right now. So does that make sense to you? What's gotten into you? I get that, Adrian, but you should have been took that in consideration before doing what we did. There's consequences for our actions. I mean, yeah, but... I just don't know, Layla. I know you've told me about how your parents are able to help you when you need something, but that won't last forever. So before you go through with this, you need to take into consideration if you think we're really ready for this. Look, I hear what you're saying, but I'll do whatever it takes to provide for this baby, our baby. But I think it's best if I just go home for now. So I'm gonna go and pack my things. Honestly, I think it's best if you go home too. Hello? Hey, mom. Hey, Layla. Is everything okay? You sound like you're crying. Honestly, I'm I'm not okay. And I just, I just want to come home. Can you and dad please come and pick me up? Um, of course we can. But what's going on? Me and Adrian got into it. And I really don't want to explain right now. But please don't be mad at me. Be mad at you? Of course we're not going to be mad at you. I, I have to finish packing up my stuff. But... I'll see you when you get here, okay? Okay, Layla. Um, whatever you're going through, just know that we love you and we'll support you. And we'll see you in a little, okay? Okay, Mom. Bye. Bye. Uh, I don't know what that was all about, but I'm definitely worried. August, come here! So Layla just called and she said that her and Adrian got into it about something and she's crying and she said she wants to come home. So I don't exactly know what happened, but what I do know is we have to go and pick her up. Well, who's gonna watch the kiddos? I didn't even think of that. 
Maybe I can call Kelly? Hopefully she's available. Yeah, give her a call because I do not want to bring them. I think it's best if we don't bring them either because we don't even know what we're walking into. Okay. Hi, Kelly. It's Mrs. Collins. Oh, hey, Mrs. Collins. How are you? Unfortunately, we have a family emergency and I was hoping you'd have some availability so you could come over and watch the kids. Oh, I wish I could, but I'm actually booked right now. I'm sorry. Oh, no worries. I understand. It was completely last minute. It's okay, though. Have a good day. Bye. Bye, Kelly. Well, obviously that's not happening. So I guess we're gonna have to have Leo watch the girls. Oh Lord, this does not seem like a good idea. Oh, uh, well, I'll go ahead and tell Leo. Okay, and I'll say bye to the girls. Okay, Leah, I'm gonna get you to get off this laptop for a second cause I have to tell you something really important. What's going on? What about me, mommy? You too, Livy, come over here. So, mommy and daddy are gonna have to go and see Layla for a little bit. She might even be coming back home with us. So while we're gone, your big brother Leo is gonna be in charge. I wanna see Layla too! Don't worry, you'll see her in a couple hours, I promise. So I'm gonna need both of you guys to listen to your brother. Leo, are you sure he is responsible to watch us? Yeah, and he can be a meanie sometimes. It can be our little secret, but how about we pretend like you guys are watching him and make sure he doesn't do anything bad. And if he does, you tell mommy when mommy gets back home. And if you give me a good report, I'll give you some candy. Okay. Okay, mommy, I'll do anything for candy. Yeah, just don't get in a white van for it, sweetie. Okay, let me go and meet your dad. But I love both of you guys. Hey Leo, uh, I think Layla and Adrian aren't getting along right now, so she might be staying home for a while. So would you mind watching your sisters while your mom and I go pick her up? Bro, do I have to? I mean, unless you want this little computer taken away, then I guess you have no other choice. Fine, I'll do it. Thank you, kiddo. Okay, so I talked to the girls. Is everything okay with Leo? I really hope we could trust him. Yes, he said he'll watch them. We are good to go. Okay, good. Okay, girls, remember what I said. All right, August, let's go. Bye, kiddos. Okay, so we just got to the gas station because we have quite the drive, so I need to stretch my legs, but, um, if you guys remember what happened uh, sometime last year with Layla, where she, you know, had a pregnancy scare, something tells me that this is the same situation. A what? Another? Um, uh, you keeping secrets now? Uh, no, no, secrets? Okay, let me stop. I I've been caught. Yes, Layla had a pregnancy scare last year and I wasn't supposed to tell you. So I don't know what to tell you. She told me not to tell you, but it was just a scare. Obviously she wasn't pregnant. I don't even know how I should feel. Keep this from me? Yes, we kept it from you. What if I was gonna be a grandpa? Would you have told me? Why are you looking me up and down like that? Or was I gonna wait? Cause you have some nerve. Yes, obviously if she was actually pregnant, we would have told you, but she wasn't. But what I don't wanna do is argue about this right now. Okay, so can we just drop it? Let me keep my calm. Yes, but we will be talking about this later. Okay, okay. Okay, so we finally made it and let's go ahead and see what's going on with these two. Here goes nothing. Hello, is everything okay in there? Uh, I don't see anybody through the window. What's taking so long? I'm getting worried. I hope Adrian didn't do anything to her. Oh, Layla. Layla! There you are. What took so long? Is everything okay? You poor thing. You look like you've been crying all day. Just come in and I'll tell you everything. Okay, okay, let's go. Okay, before I get into it, 
Just promise me you won't freak out. I mean, I can make that promise, but I don't know about your dad. I mean, I could try, but I'm not making any promises. Okay, so long story short, I took a pregnancy test because I was feeling awful this morning. And, um, I'm pregnant. Oh my gosh, I knew it. You knew? I mean, yeah, I was figuring you were hiding something from us. For one, we haven't seen you in God knows how long. And two, I just... I don't know, I just had this gut feeling. So what I'm hearing is you are pregnant? Cause your mom just told me about the scare you had a couple months ago. What? Mom, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I know you trusted me to keep your secret, but it just slipped out. But I will say I'm finally gonna be a grandpa. Wait, hold on. Is that what you and Adrian decided? Where is Adrian? Matter of fact, because you said you guys got into it earlier. So what happened with that? I don't know, and I honestly don't care right now. Uh-uh. Adrian needs to get his behind downstairs. So where he at? Adrian! Excuse me, Adrian. Sir! Yeah, I don't like the way he's looking at us, for real. What is going on between you two? Oh, uh, hi, Mr. and Mrs. Collins. Hello? So what's going on and why do you look so upset? Because when Layla had that pregnancy scare, you was all for it and you were saying you were gonna be so supportive and now what? Now it's crickets? What happened? You wanna do grown folk things? You need to handle this. This is not a joke. Be an adult, right? I get it, you guys are young, but there are definitely ways to prevent this from happening. So about that. I was thinking about the whole situation realistically. Okay, and what exactly did you conclude from that? I don't think Layla and I are ready to raise our own child. But y'all were ready to... Yeah, exactly what he said. And since we want to talk about things realistically, most people are not ready for these kind of things. You learn as you go. And from what I'm hearing, it sounds like Layla wants to keep it. Is that right? I mean, I don't want to speak for you. But I don't like what I'm seeing right now. I don't either. I understand that. I just think I need some more time to think it all through. I mean, not everybody is fortunate enough to have their own kids. So the fact that we're able to is such a blessing. So yes, I'm keeping it. I'm gonna be a grandpa. And I'm gonna be a grandma. Yay. I'm happy, but we don't have to come up with another name because grandma does not sound cute. Now you. Yeah, you better start getting ready to be the father of your child. Well, it seems like you got a couple months to figure it out, Adrian. And you better tell your dad too. We have more than enough time to prepare. I mean, that's kind of true, but these months are gonna go by really fast. Cause this is my first grandchild we're talking about. And I want them to live the best life. I'll use all the time I have wisely. I sure hope so. Come on, Layla, let me help you finish up packing your stuff. Oh Lord, this is not what I expected, but we roll with the punches around here. Okay. Okay, so it looks like we got most of the stuff. Can you just make sure that those two bottom drawers are cleared? And everything else is Adrian's, so we should be good to go. And I just want to let you know while the boys are downstairs that I'm really proud of you for standing your ground and also we're not mad at you. You said that on the phone and we would never be mad at you. And it's okay that you're taking a little break from school. Maybe you can do some online classes if you feel like you want to. And we love you no matter what. Aw, mom. I love you too. Okay, honey. Well, this is the last of it. Okay, I'm sorry if I kind of overreacted in the moment. I just expected you to show some sort of excitement. I know. And you shouldn't be sorry. I'm not mad at you. Just uh frustrated with myself for being unprepared and i understand i have just as much responsibility as you do in this situation well when you get settled i'll come by okay i love you leela i really do i love you too adrian and i'll let you know when we make it i know i'm being a little nosy right now but i'm glad to hear that they're kind of working everything out because that was a mess okay well i'll go ahead and get in the car Okay, so we have finally made it back home and I know the kids are gonna be so excited to see their big sister. Kiddos, we're home! 
And we have a guest. And uh, what is going on over here? You are sick. And your feet smell like cheese, Weo. Oh, hey, Mom and Dad. You got the girls rubbing on your nasty, crusty feet? Um, what's going on? Girls, you do not have to be doing that. That is disgusting, Leo. This isn't what I meant by babysitting. I missed you. Hi! I missed you guys so much more! Back up, Leo! You don't get Layla's hugs! And, Leo, I told you to make Livy put on a shirt! She is gonna catch a cold! It's freezing outside! Oh my goodness! Okay, whatever! He was bossing us around the whole time you were gone! I did tell her! This girl doesn't listen! Yeah, mommy! We have some more important news! Yeah, kiddos! Listen up! Oh, right. I'm pregnant! I'm gonna be a grandpa! Break it down! Get it! Get it! Get it, August! Get it, August! What? Pregnant? And I'm gonna be a grandma! Stop playing! Another baby? Mm-hmm. I'm being so for real! I'm gonna be an uncle! I'm gonna be an aunt? How did it get in there? The stork brought the baby to Layla. And now she's going to be a mommy, just like me. Yeah, that's exactly how it works. <laughs> I want to see the baby. Well, we can't quite see it yet, but Layla is going to go to the doctor soon and maybe we can get a picture of it, also known as an ultrasound. Okay, well, we're going to go ahead and catch up with Layla for a while and then figure out what we're going to do about her room. <laughs> It actually makes me really happy that we're going to be able to do something with this room again. So yeah, uh, you'll have Grandma Annie's old room and Reese's old room. I really wish you got a chance to meet him, but hopefully you will because he's still going to be a part of our lives. We could do a lot with this space. I mean, if you and Adrian kind of wanted to just chill here until you guys, you know have the baby, hopefully all goes well. Then when you guys, you know, get back on your feet and stuff, you guys can move out and look for a new place because as much as I love you guys, y'all are not going to be staying here forever. But for now, you can. So I guess you're going to have to sleep on the couch until we get this room decorated. And the couch isn't as bad as it seems. But if you have any ideas, feel free to let me know. You don't understand how much I appreciate you guys. Well, let's go ahead and schedule your appointment so we can make sure that everything is okay with the baby. And we can also see how far along you are. Okay, everyone. Well, that is going to be it for this video. We are so, so happy to hear that Layla is finally pregnant. I know you guys have been wanting this for a really long time, but if you enjoyed, do not forget to leave a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below. Once you are subscribed, click the bell button so you get notified whenever I post a video. And with that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Bye! Good.